Hey everybody, I got the uh, most of the stuff that I needed to get done done. I got the drag cable repaired and I have the fuses put in for the strobes. I got my strobe back so I put the fuses in and I put the diode on the, the starter, the contactor, the battery contactor, starter contactor. So I'm gonna show you it's running and I'll be right back. Okay, fuel on, fuel pump on, master on, starter, clear prop. Grabbed the wrong one. Oh well. At least that's the fast way to get it back. It's hot right now. Yeehaw. All right. Anyway, that's the deal. So hope you guys enjoy my update. 
And thank you all for subscribing once again. If it wasn't for you guys, I wouldn't be doing this. And um, <clears throat> I'm not sure, God, I forgot your name. The one that asked me about the measurements for the trailer. I told you on my comment that Dennis Carley said a 14 foot trailer, it's probably standard size, whatever it is, seven feet wide, that'll work. So that's all you need pretty much. But like I say, it's not gonna be easy to, to take apart, put back together because you gotta take the tail feathers apart, the wings gotta come off, the struts gotta come off, you know, the wing struts. So it's not going to be an easy take, take it apart, put it back together kind of thing. But it is doable. And Dennis Carley said people do it all the time. The thing is, is that it's not convenient. Like the Kolbs with the fold up wings. You can pretty much leave them together and just push them on a trailer. And then just fold up the wing, or fold up the wings and push them on a trailer. But this one's not that easy. So um, if you're going to use it regularly, the trailer is probably not going to work out for you. But if you're going to store it and you need a hanger, a rolling hanger, portable hanger, that'll work. So I'm going to let y'all go for now and I'm going to go home and try to put this thing together and get this thing online so this way you got something to see. So we'll talk to you soon and all I can say is um, I'm not going to use Trent Palmer's line come and be my wingman but Come on back and visit, and visit often, because, you know, hopefully I'm going to have this thing put back together within the next couple of weeks, and hopefully sooner. And once I get it put back together, then I can do some ground handling, taxing, so, so on and so forth, with it all put, put together. So until then, we'll talk to you soon. See ya.